become a, a business coach having um, been involved um, in the early 90s with, uh, with a coaching firm and the results uh, that I uh, obtained from them at the time when I needed um, some support and structure in, in the two companies that I was running. And uh, going through that process uh, um, allowed me to believe that uh, you know, coaching was very effective in actually achieving what you want. And I decided to become a coach when I came across Action Coach and did a lot of uh, research on Action Coach. And uh, the biggest thing I get out of it is uh, helping other people. Every business needs a coach because the, from time to time you get distracted uh, with various issues and you start to lose focus um, on what's really important and uh, what your actual goals are. And um, I think when people start off in a business they, they have very good skills and, um, or abilities and uh, they don't necessarily know how to run a business. And having somebody help them guide them through the process um, in a logical manner to achieve uh, the results that they want to achieve. Um, makes it uh, you know, a lot smoother for them. I love coaching business owners uh, because of the results that I get. Um, um, I love to see business owners who are struggling uh, to make um, headway and um, they are working long hours and they are not making the amount of money that they expected to make when they first started out their business. And I like seeing the, that changing around and them starting to get the results that, uh, that they expected to get in the, in the first days of opening up the business. Action. Coach had a dramatic impact on my life. Um, when I go back to the, uh, the predecessors, um, when I was um, involved uh, with, a, uh, with a coaching company and, and following the steps and, um, that they outlined and um, following those processes, allowed me to move to a situation where um, I was no longer working in the business, I had um, a lot more freedom um, and the company was running uh, very well without as much effort uh, on my part and um, I thought if I could impart a lot of that, um, uh, that knowledge or those ideas onto other people that uh, they'd all benefit. The three things that make me a good coach is first of all I'm a, I'm a good listener. And uh, I think that's very important to a lot of business owners who, in a lot of cases, may have a network of friends and, um, uh, and colleagues, but they don't always necessarily explain the real issues um, that may be confronting their business. And so the fact that I, I listen um, to what they're actually saying, um, I think is, uh, is very good for them, and which makes me a, a better mentor, I believe. Um, I also uh, have empathy um, from the point of view that um, having been a small business myself, I know some of the heartache and some of the issues that they go through and um, I think that allows me to align myself closely um, with, the, um, uh, with my clients. And the third thing too is, uh, is motivating. Um, I can uh, motivate them um, to actually move ahead and, uh, and do what they need to do. For me, the biggest thing that uh, I get from business owners is, uh, is financial mastery. Uh, and the financial mastery allows them to start developing a plan that's going to get them to where they want to go. And I find so many small business owners don't really understand much about um, things like profit and loss and, um, and balance sheets. And taking them through those processes and how the financial statements can actually be a tool for them to use on a day-to-day -day basis to run their company, um, I find that uh, very effective. I believe my clients uh, like me um, uh, as a coach, A, because as I mentioned, um, I, uh, I do listen to, uh, to their issues and then work them through the process. Probably the most common feedback I get from my clients is that they have uh, the confidence to make decisions that they previously wouldn't have made and uh, the confidence for them to actually move forward. And a lot of my clients now have moved into investments and um, outside of their, their business that they, they previously wouldn't have done so if, um, if I wasn't working with them. I think in the first place uh, what we need to do is sit down and, uh, and discuss um, your issues to see whether or not uh, you, you do need a coach. And if you decided you, you did need a coach and, uh, and we decided that we could work together, um, the reason why I'd be a good coach is that um, I know through Action Coach's uh, systems and, and tools 
um, and with my mentoring capabilities, uh, we can take you through to uh, to the levels of your business that uh, that you want to go.